Good afternoon. According to the Rutherford Health Department, as of 3 p.m. today, the total number of COVID-19 positive cases in Rutherford has risen to a total of 173. The residents with new positive results range in age from 26 to 44. The situation continues to be closely monitored by our health department. Our first responders continue to take all possible precautions when assisting our community. We'd like to remind you that ticketing for alternate side of the street parking will resume on May 4th, which is this Monday. Please help us keep your neighborhood beautiful by remembering to move your car on your scheduled day. We'd like to congratulate Rutherford resident Christine Bidell for being chose, chosen as a Burton County hero by Burton County freeholder Tracy Zor. Christine and four other Burton County residents founded the Burton Mass Task Force. Together, they used their skills to wash sewable fabric masks for frontline heroes around Bergen County and New York City. What these five women started has grown into a force of 400 volunteers producing thousands of masks. Your ingenuity and your generosity is truly inspiring, and we hope more people follow in your footsteps. The Rutherford Community Pantry continues to serve those in need. We'd like to take a second to thank our Director of Social Services, Genevieve Kazmarek, for her tireless efforts in finding ways to provide necessities while practicing social distancing during a time when our most vulnerable population needs her the most. The main needs list is currently available at rutherfordcommunitypantry.org. Please be mindful of the limited inventory space at the pantry. While all donations are appreciated, the items listed on this site truly are the most needed at this time. This weekend is the Digital Action Weekend for the United States Census. It's important that we all be counted as Rutherford receives federal funding and grants based on our population. It also factors into our representation in Washington, D.C. If you're curious about how well Rutherford has responded to the census or need to fill out the census for your household, visit 2020census.gov. When posting online, please use hashtag 2020census to encourage your family, friends, and loved ones to complete the census as well. We'd like to announce that the Military Tribute Banner Project is now active thanks to an idea from resident Ann Hurry. Families will have the opportunity to purchase a banner on behalf of those currently serving or who have served in our American Armed Forces. The banners will be displayed on light poles throughout Park Avenue and Union Ave and will dis be displayed from Memorial Day to Veterans Day. Please take a look at our website for the application on the Permits, Licenses, and Applications page. This, of course, is a fluid situation and the borough is in constant communication with county and state officials. As needed, we'll be updating residents by borough website, Twitter, and Facebook daily. We hope that you enjoy the weekend and please be mindful that our parks are, are still closed for the safety of you and our neighbors. And that is something that we will continue to look at on a weekly basis. Thank you, Rutherford. Enjoy your weekend.